Hey everyone, it's Eyal Booker here. I'm a TV personality and a model, and I'm Jewish. In the Jewish religion at the moment, it is Passover. And Passover is a Jewish festival in order to celebrate the release of the Jewish people from slavery in Egypt. Usually I will spend Passover with my immediate and extended family. There will be about 25 to 30 of us all gathering at somebody's house. I'll talk you through the kind of steps of what happens. Everyone arrives, we all catch up, we sit around the table, and then we go through the story of Passover. We read from a book and everyone goes round and reads a page of the Passover book. And then we get the Seder plate out. And the Seder plate is basically a plate that's designed to have all different pieces of food on it that represents and signify a part of the Passover story. Everybody takes a piece of food from that plate and we stick to kind of the rituals that we do in order to remember what the Jewish people went through during slavery and to honor the sacrifices that they made so we can live freely. Another tradition for Passover that I remember as a kid was find the afikoman. And so the afikoman was a piece of matzo bread and it was wrapped into some tissue paper or anything and it was hidden around um, the house or the flat or wherever you were and at a certain point in the night all the kids would get together and on the count of three everyone would race around trying to find this hidden piece of matzo called the afikoman and the kid that found it would get a small prize. It was the game of the night and it was the little bit of competition and everyone was running around going crazy and it was it's something I always remember and hopefully when I have a family and when I have kids they will search my house or flat high and low, turn it upside down looking for the afikoman. The Seder night is a beautiful night where we just spend quality time together as family. Morale is super high. We sing really fun Passover songs and we give thanks to being free and for what people sacrificed. This year, because we are not able to gather together as one big family, we're gonna be holding a virtual Seder night. We've got a Zoom account and everyone's gonna be logging into the Zoom account. I live with my two brothers, so we're gonna be sat at our dinner table with our Seder table laid out. Um, my great uncle's gonna be there taking us through the, the story of Passover whilst also saying the prayers. And we're gonna try and find that spirit and morale that we usually have when we're all together. But virtually, we're gonna try to maintain that tradition even though we're adapting it to the current times that we live in. For me, Passover is a celebration of our freedom, a time to get together with my family and friends and spend quality time, reminisce on the history of the Jewish people and spread love, positivity and happiness.